Welcome to 843 TV. I'm your host, Will Wareham with WHHI TV. And I'm your host, Carrie mm -hmm. Manning from Deo Valente. Today we are here at Mike Rickenbosch Chevrolet. So our first guest is Miss Audrey Rickenbosch. She is the Director of Business Development here at Mike Rickenbosch Chevrolet. Our second guest is Daniela Augustine Squickero with the Greater Bluffton Chamber of Commerce. And then last but not least, we have Miss Trish Heichel with the Community Foundation of the Low Country. So stick around for more 843 TV. Where communities come to speak. Eight four three TV, where Bluffton comes to speak, where Spring Island comes to speak, where Hilton Head Island comes to speak, where Beaufort comes to speak. Eight four three TV, where communities come to speak. Welcome to 843 TV. We're here this morning with Miss Audrey Rickenbach. She is the Director of Business Development out here at Mike Rickenbach Chevrolet. How are you this morning? I'm good. So we have all kinds of fun events to talk about this morning. And the first one, which is an upcoming event that everybody in the neighborhood is always excited about, is the Bluffton Christmas Break. Yes. You guys are going to have a float this year and a couple little extras. Tell everybody about that. We are. Uh, the parade is so fun. It's, uh, it's like the epitome of a small town parade, which is what I love about Bluffton anyway. But everybody turns out and we are um, su supplying the cars for the Pl Bluffton Police Department. And so we have over 10 vehicles in the parade this year and we are doing the vote for the, uh, the Bluffton Chamber. So we plan on having a really good time out there and showing our support for Christmas and which for Bluffton. I can't Bluffton. believe it's here. Uh, yeah. <laughs> there it is, right around the corner. Yeah. Yeah. And it gets bigger and bigger every year. It does. So if you're new and you haven't visited the Bluffton Christmas Parade, you need to put that yeah, on your come calendar. Out. Yeah. Absolutely. And yes. that is, we're all super excited about that and mm -hmm. uh, really looking forward to seeing that. And as far as um, sponsoring things, getting involved in the um, uh, community, and speaking of the Chamber, of course, yes. you are also sponsoring the Miss Bluffton pageant we this are. year. We are. We're excited about yeah. that. It's the first time that we were able to sponsor it this year, and we're looking forward to it. Um, Hannah Brown did such a good job this past year. Um, she you did. said that she won the talent contest. Uh, the preliminaries, the, the yeah, preliminaries, she did. yeah. Mm -hmm. So yes, we are sponsoring that, and um, the popularity for it or the interest for it is growing. It's um, just a really good way to. Uh, it, they, they provide scholarships for young women, and um, it's just a really good program. And we're happy to be involved in it. Absolutely. And to everybody it. is very glad that you are involved in Thanks. it. So thank you for that. Pageants are serious business here in the local. They, they are. <laughs> they are. And what a great opportunity for the girls and young ladies of Bluffton as well. So I'm it sure is. that they greatly appreciate your involvement. I think it's great. You all are so involved in so many different sponsorships here in the community and, and we all feel that love that you give to your community. One of the things that you're sponsoring or have sponsored is the Sun City Car Club. Yes. Obviously there's a good connection there. there Tell is. me about that. Well, of course, the cars. <laughs> so we took um, quite a few, I think we took three Corvettes over, which got a huge response because they're beautiful. Um, but what we really like about it is uh, Jim Batista is the vice president for the Sun City Car Club, and their decision is all proceeds and all money that they raise goes to Memory Matters. And that's a really important issue to all of us. And so we were able to donate over $1,000 this year that's a lot to memory matters that's and um, they appreciate it and I appreciate the community in Sun City getting behind that cause and I'm just really glad that we could help oh great job congratulations and memory matters really kind of to help uh, fight Alzheimer's right and yes it does yeah and that's uh, something that uh, is, is, in the, is in the news a lot in, in, the, in the popular culture because mm -hmm. uh, we've got a, um, yeah. a lot of people suffering from that we in do our, in our and it's always community. in the back of your mind mm -hmm. it is when you can't find your keys right. <laughs> That's right. So, yes. So you've got some upcoming events that you're sponsoring, but you just mm -hmm. got finished with some big ones. Yes, October right? is really big in the Low Country yes, here in Bluffton. Yes, we were everywhere. <laughs> yeah, we just did the Taste of Waddell mm -hmm. out at the Waddell Mariculture Center and raised money um, for the Mariculture Center specifically. Okay. Um, they protect the waterways and they raise fish and shrimp and oysters mm -hmm. and monitor the waterways and. Uh, make sure that it's clean and healthy so okay. that Bluffton can be Bluffton. Right. Because without it, without the beautiful clean water and the wildlife that live in it, 
we've got to protect them. We do have to protect them. And so how, 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 what was your involvement in the taste of uh, Waddell? The taste of Waddell? Mm -hmm. um, they let me take some a few cars out there, basically, mm -hmm. and we donated money to okay. them. Okay. You know, so help that it, they need money. Right. They need help money to work. do that to pay all those people and <laughs> right. raise all those fish. Um, but actually, I had a really great time. Yeah. Great music, delicious food, and really, really nice, caring people in Bluffton. Yep, absolutely. When you get out to these festivals and these uh, events, you m meet people who care about different aspects that are going on in the community, but so many good people live here. Mm -hmm. And so many people volunteer yes. to protect the things that are important to them. And to make so, these things just work. fun. <laughs> and yeah. talk about another festival with great food and great entertainment, the uh, recent historic Bluffton Arts and Seafood yes. Festival. You sponsored the music, the entertainment for we that did. festival? We did. We sponsored the music. It was mm -hmm. really good this year. They yeah. did a great job. There's music on every corner, and mm -hmm. we sponsored the music stage, and the food is fabulous. The hard-working people who were there so early cooking food the night before and bringing it and serving it to us. <laughs> um, the music, uh, the artists. Yes. There's so much here. It's just a such a rich, talent. yeah, so much <laughs> talent. <laughs> so you get to just get to go out and hang out with all those really cool people. And that's no small production either. That's a 10-day event, right? It's a 10-day <laughs> event. We yeah. were somewhere every day. There's always something going on. Yeah. Um, yes. And, and that's another event that has grown every yeah. single year. Yeah. And it, it, it literally does have something for everybody. It covers it does. the realm. Yeah. If you can't have fun, then you need to stay home. I just can't, you know, and if you missed it, I'm sorry. It's really, really fun. It's a really good festival. Well, it sounds like it. you all are, are, are really contributing and, and giving back to the community and as a, uh, as a business, and so we really appreciate all that you do for the you. town of Bluffton and, the, and yeah. Beaufort County. It's very important to us. Good. Yeah, good. if we're going to live mm -hmm. here and uh, business, it's our yeah. neighborhoods, That's you right. know, so mm -hmm. we like to give back to our communities. Well, thank you for doing all that You're you do, welcome. and thank you for joining us today on 843 TV. Thanks, Will. And stick around for another segment of 843 TV. Yeah. In the last